What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jonathan and today we're making Boba Fett's blaster from the Mandalorian. Let's go. These great files I'm using were designed by Cameron Thomas. As always, I'll put a link in the description. Cameron split this file into 10 pieces for easy printing and assembly. Now for the fun part, sanding. I like to start off with a lower grit, like 60 or 80, and then work my way up from there. I'll share my full sanding and priming method a little bit later in the video. Typically after the first round of sanding and priming, I'll go back over the print and look at any real deep layer lines. You can see some here. And I hit those areas with a little bit of Bondo. The Bondo just really helps cover up those layer lines a little bit more and honestly you could really cover the entire print in this if you wanted to. And the last step is wet sanding. The wet sanding is what gives it a really nice smooth finish. I used quite a few different kind of paints here. I used some spray paint, some acrylics. I even experimented with some wood stain. And you can see them all here. And then I also did this super cool thing with, yes, toothpaste. You basically just use the toothpaste to mask off certain spots on the print, and then once the paint is dry, you go back and you wipe away the toothpaste. And you had this really cool, weathered, worn look. painting the handles brown I decided to go back over them with a cheap little chip brush trying to mimic the look of wood I don't know how good it came out but it definitely added a little bit of depth to it and finally the last piece just a little bit of weathering with some watered down black acrylic paint weapon I've ever done and overall there's definitely some things I need to get better at and uh, more patient at I'm really happy with the outcome of this I think it's a uh, really cool and you know honestly it came out better than I really ever thought it would so if you have any feedback go ahead and put that down in the comments I really like reading what you guys think about these 3d prints that I do I have quite a few more planned uh, for the rest of this year and in the next year so if you're not subscribed already please hit that subscribe button along with the notification bell so you miss future videos again thanks for clicking on this video thanks for checking it out and hope you guys are back for the next one bye